Thank you very much, Johnny, here with Kevin Franzen, who spent part of his afternoon today at the Children's National Medical Center with your wife, Amanda, from what I understand. Um, what can you tell me about that experience, how meaningful it was for you to be there, and what it was like to just spend some time with the kids? Uh, you know, it was a, it, it's a tremendous feeling just to go there and, uh, you know, being a part of it, my, basically my whole life at a children's hospital, um, you know, on the other side of experiencing with my, my older brother battling through cancer, um, there's nothing better than going there and, and trying to create a uh, distraction from the everyday adversity these kids are going through, um, whether, you know, it's cancer or, or, or some sort of transplant that they're going through. Um, you know, it, like I said, it's always fun to be there but it sucks to see what those kids are going through and the families are going through. Um, you know, my whole goal is, is to bring five, 10 minutes of, of just, a, you know, pure like joy. Um, when my brother was sick all those years and athletes would come into Stanford Children's Hospital and, and visit him and, or, and all the other patients, uh, just seeing him smile for five minutes made me feel so much better because that, you don't like seeing your older brother, let alone a family member, anyone suffer. But uh, the distraction was, you know, that's what you go for. And this time it was, you know, special for me because the, the uh, last year we went the first time, Amanda got to experience it with me. And, uh, you know, this year, you know, as my wife, it was even a, a bigger deal because, uh, you know, it, it's a part of us. It's a part of who we are and, and, and my family. How much did those times that your brother got visited by an athlete when he was young and when you were there with him, how much did you sense that impacting him and how much has that uh, led to you wanting to continuously be a part of this process? Uh, basically my whole life I, I saw it. I, I saw how, how much it impact him. Um, it, it would impact you know his go the distance never give up uh, model that he lived by. Um, you know whether it was Jerry Rice, Joe Montana, Steve Young, Matt Williams, uh, <laughs> Dave Rigetti, uh, Mike Kruko would come in, you know, they would, they would bring an energy, a positive vibe, uh, you know, not the star struck thing, but just the, this, this whole new, uh, new wave of energy. And so when I got called up in 2006 with the Giants, I made sure I, I had, since my brother passed away, I, I hadn't been back to uh, Stanford Children's Hospital, let alone visit a hospital, um, because I struggled with it. And, um, you know, my first thing was I wanted to conquer that, and I did. And going back and just seeing the first patient just smile and just like laugh and do all that, it was, it was so uplifting. It was, it, I was on the other side now. How much does this help you feel like a part of the DC community? And uh, like this is this is a passion that you have, but you're continuing it here in a, in a new city with a new organization. Uh, it's pretty awesome to be honest with you, uh, because it's so new for you know Amanda and I being here. Uh, Going into a few of the rooms and people knowing who you were it was actually, you know, it's, it's nice. You know, when you're a utility guy, you you get accustomed to being, you know, the the person laying in the weeds, and that's fine. That's that's how we're supposed to do our job. You know, like come in whenever you get. But when people recognize you and do all that, it's kind of fun too at the same time. Um, but I want them to recognize me for and and Amanda for coming in and and just being ourselves, not being. Oh, I play for the Nationals. That's why I'm here. No, it, it matters that I'm there because I know what you guys are going through. I want to help, and my help is not trying to, you know, make a cure for this. But the cure of the day is is a smile, is a laughter, or something like that. And uh, I think we accomplished that today. So it was pretty pretty fun.